Scott, aka Garage Golf, uh, created a nice video tutorial on downloading and installing JNPG courses. But uh, a lot of the newcomers are having trouble grasping the concept, so I thought I'd show you a much easier way to accomplish the same thing. And to do this, in Windows 10, we can use this thing called Quick Access to create a link to the Courses folder so that you can jump to it immediately, almost when you uh, ever you, you want to go there. So the first thing we have to do is add that Courses folder to the Quick Access. Now this may work on Windows 8 and possibly Windows 7, but I'm not certain. But since most people are on Windows 10, this will work. So the first thing we have to do is is uh, locate the courses folder on your hard drive. Now most people will have it Steam installed either in program files or program files x86 and somewhere in there you'll you'll find a uh, installation folder called Steam. Now I don't have mine installed there. I, in fact I have a separate partition on a hard drive called Steam and there's my Steam installation folder. So what we have to do now is just navigate through the, the folder uh, to locate the courses folder. First thing we want to do is go to Steam Apps, double click, go to Common, double click, Perfect Golf, double click, Courses, double click. And this is where the courses are located. Now we want to get this courses folder located over here in the quick access area. So we left click on the courses and hold down the mouse button and drag it over here over top of quick access till it says pin to quick access and it'll create the courses folder in the quick access now. Now no matter where you are to get back to your courses all you gotta do is click there and you're instant, instantly <coughs> excuse me, to the course folder. So now let's take a look at downloading a course and installing it. See how easy that is. Uh, first of all, you can either, you can get the courses by going to either the uh, forum website, click on courses, or if you go to the simulator website, click on courses, and they'll take you both to the same place, so it doesn't really matter. So let's go ahead and I'm going to download Pasta Tiempo. And I can either download it from this link or click on the expand a little bit and get a little bit of information about the course. So now that I see it, read it all, I can just click on the link here and it will start downloading. And once we get the download page, just click on download and let her let her do its thing. Now most of you probably won't have this little window appearing. Most of you probably have it automatically set to automatically save in your downloads folder. I don't do that personally because I like to know where I'm putting stuff on my PC. And I would normally just open it up in Windows Explorer. But I'm going to go ahead and save the file and uh, then we'll show you how to get it from your downloads folder and put it into the courses folder. So I'll go to the downloads and downloads. I'm just going to save it. Okay, now I can close the browser because it's saved. Okay, now we have the course 
I can use uh, the quick access to go to downloads or you, there's another place down here in PC called downloads. Either one will take you to the to the folder and there it is. All you have to do to install it now is double click on this zip file and it's extracted it temporarily into a folder. We just have to take this folder and drag it, left mouse click and hold and drag it, place it on the courses folder and bingo it's, it's installed. Now the only thing you want to do when you install courses is probably take a look to make sure you don't have duplicates. So we come down here and there's Posse Tempo and I don't have a duplicate but if I did I'd want to go ahead and delete the the oldest version. But that's how easy it is now no matter where you are you can always get to your courses very quickly by just clicking on the courses in the quick access area. Much simpler and uh, I hope you find this very helpful.